Everybody knows on here that I've been uh, trying to get my disability, and they've sent me over here for an evaluation in Kingsport. So that's where I'm headed to. A little bit early, but I'm going to leave a little early to make sure I didn't have no trouble finding it. I know I talked to a few of y'all in the comments, and. Uh, Y'all know me and my mom had been sick. Thankful, thankful to y'all for uh, the good words and the prayers and the good comments and everything for me and my mom and for the prayers that we got better and getting better and stuff and everything. And really appreciate y'all. Hope uh, everybody's doing okay. She went and, uh, to the doctor, and the walk in nurse said she didn't have COVID. Then the walk in doctor, he come in and said it was COVID. Then I think the next morning, I got up to let Lucky and Tiny out, and I was chilling and felt terrible. So I guess she already had it, I guess, in her system, more or less. She just went, got to put feeling worse and went for a checkup, I guess you could say. That's when she found out she had it. Anyways, uh, Might be a little of it still hanging around, like a little bit of cough or something like that, but other than that, it seemed to be doing a lot better. I mean, uh, I guess you call this Colonial Heights in Kingsport, Tennessee. I'm going over about middle ways of Kingsport to that appointment. So I thought I'd bring y'all along with me here and uh, say hey to everybody. I zoomed that camera up a little bit. I'm using that GoPro on the dash, uh, one I'm recording with right now. But uh, I've got it zoomed uh, almost all the way up to the far as it go. I hope I didn't overdo it. I hope it's all right. But, uh, anyways, I'm going to get on over towards that place I'm looking for, and, uh, I'll let y'all ride around with me here for a little bit. to where you turn up into Warriors Pass State Park. Many y'all, some of y'all probably know where that's at. That's been around here before. Uh, that's actually the red light I'm coming up on now. You can turn right here and go to Warriors Pass State Park. That music don't come on here. I don't need no copyright. Somebody beside of me blaring that stereo. I don't know if that's a a group or something. He just playing off of the phone or something. I don't know, but I can hear it over here. I, mean, I don't know what that is.
YouTube's funny about that stuff. Or if they hear a little bit of music in the background, they want to send a copyright warning or at least a little old thing that, like it. I don't know about them. I don't understand, but it happens. Stopped back there and got a tea at McDonald's. And right when I was pulling in, the windshield, like a mist, come across the window. I don't know if somebody sprayed their windows next to me or if it come up with the hood or what it was. I thought it was going to try to start raining, but I don't really know what was going on. Looks like it could rain though. I didn't think I was going to ever get my taste back where I could taste anything. That was uh, one of the bad things about being sick. I guess it was COVID because of that, but uh, I, for about a week, I couldn't taste nothing. I think the first thing I've tasted that tasted halfway decent, I like one of those uh, Red Bull Blueberry flavored Red Bulls. One day I drank a little bit of one of them and I could taste the blueberry taste in it a little bit. And it seemed like my taste started coming back a little bit more and more and more after that. Big old senior living place they built. I ain't been over through here in a while. It's over to my left. That's a big old place. jump off here for a minute or two and uh getting a little bit closer over in here i'm gonna be in some traffic but i will turn the camera back on in a little bit and uh check back in with you there. like i said i'm just driving to my appointment right now i will be back in a little bit bye now hello everybody I've done with my appointment over here. I'm just now leaving. About two o'clock. I guess they was busy or something or other. My appointment was at 1230 and that's exactly when they come out there and got me. Then checked me out, done this, done that, then about 30 minutes went by to come in there and check me. Twisted my legs and hands and arms and checked me out all over like they do. So I'm heading back to Johnson City. I don't know if it's supposed to snow or what it is. It cooled off since I've been in there. that lady in there telling her she seen something on I guess the radar that was all around them here I don't know if she was talking about rain or snow but I do know it cooled off I'm 
No blowing, we're not being in there. Here at the red light at East Center Street, Dobbins Bennett High School is to my right. stabilizer on that camera that thing is just shaking like crazy on these old roads old roads is rough down here at Fort Henry Drive Kingsport. Like I said I hadn't been over in here in a while when I was able to when I was able to work and stuff. I done heating and air. I worked a lot over in here in Kingsport, different areas. And Kylie knew the area pretty good then, but things change as you go along. Gotta tell you, Mike, if you're watching this, I cheated. I got a McDonald's tea earlier. Didn't get a pal's tea today. Tiny and Lucky be mad at me. Nice big old nice sign for the Fort Henry Mall. A lot of cars over there. It must be about closed. So I guess that's the back side. this camera off because right around the corner here is where I stopped filming coming over this way. Might drive down in there around Warriors Path, the park, and see how much the lake's up or down. I know they drained it over there next to our side of town in Johnson City. Over there around my mom's, it's down pretty low. I don't know exactly where Boone and Hoston and then meet over in here somewhere, I guess. I think this part of the lake out here around Warriors might be some of it Hoston, some of it Boone, I think. I don't really know. 
anyways, I will be back in a few minutes. Switch that recording setting down to F8, I can't even say it, FHD. I had it on 4K, but I know my SD card's getting about full. No. I thought I might run out of time there on it, and I didn't want to do that, me trying to record. I think that 4K might take up a little more room, I don't know. I don't use that 4K a lot, especially out driving. Now, when I'm out walking or around or out with the dogs or whatever, out with Tiny or Lucky out at my mom's, I'll use that 4K, but driving, I don't use it as much. Cause I can't use, for one, I can't use that stabilizer in these old bumpy roads. Uh, you about have to have it on. The way mine's mounted on the dash anyway, you about have to have it on. <coughs> one of these days, I might get, be able to get me one of them Galaxy 8s or one of them newer ones that's got that stabilization on it, which my phone's got stabilization on it, but a couple of them settings you can't use it on. But, I you know one of you all told me about that 8 worked pretty good for video one. And I've, I know some YouTubers that use the 7 Black and the 8, so I don't know. Now they got that 9 and 10 out. Uh, heard some people throw off on that GoPro 9, so I don't know. Might it overheating or something. And a couple other things, I don't remember exactly what all it was. Freezing up, that's what it was doing. One of them guys I watched on YouTube, he, uh, Said he was going to get a 10. So that 9 kept freezing up or something. Going down into Warriors Pass. I'm just going down here around the lake part. I'm not going down in there. That I know out here is where that little girl from Rogers will. Uh, down around that horse barn and stuff, riding stables. Down there is where she was uh, swimming and stuff, and then that evening she disappeared. I'm not going down in there, because there's been so many YouTubers out here filming that, and down there around her mom and dad's house, and running around all over Kingsport trying to make videos out here and around their house and everything else. Some of them's doing it for a good cause and I think some of them's doing it for views. That's my personal opinion. Everybody's got one, but if they're doing it trying to help, it's one thing. If they're doing it just to try to build a YouTube channel, make views or money off of it, is uh, that's a pretty sad situation. Like I said, I'm not going down there where she was swimming now. I'm just going down here at the other end, around the lake down here where the people go when the park's open. What's going on here? Trying to stop me there for a minute, didn't want me coming in here. Down a little bit. I could turn that GoPro on and hold it out the other way instead of just showing the road. Rolled my wind down, hope it don't start picking that muffler noise up.
Get ready to upload this video. I'll have to turn one of the sounds off on one of them. Uh, I still got the one running on the dash, but uh, I'll just film one with the GoPro out here it's on the water. Let's make some up behind me now. I'll be back. Go speed bump. I guess they're working on construction down in that part. I guess I'll stay out there because I'm down there in their way. coming out here in the summertime when it's warm. Turn the camera a minute. I didn't want that guy to think I was videoing him. about being videoed so I kind of respect well not weird but they just don't want to be videoed and I respect that so I kind of turn the camera around the other way for a minute Back. Huh. A little squirrel under that yellow car I was eating, he got another one sneaking up behind him. Bump, bump. I missed that bump. Well, I didn't about miss it. I about hit it. I've seen it. Uh, that makes sense. It about snuck up on me. I guess I should have said.
speed bump. That's a tall one too. come out here I guess they still let them in the summertime they'll come out here and hang around pull off their these little side the road area here and used to I know uh, people had like nice cars they come out here and sit around and shoot the breeze and little low riders and hot rods come out here and kind of hang around sit here beside the road and talk or whatever crews do here like on Saturday or Sunday. I don't know if they still let them do that or not. I mean, the warm weather, anyway. It's a nice place out here in the summertime. If I've ever even been down, I was talking about them horse stable there. I said, I'm gonna go down in there. I don't know if I've ever even been out there or not. I mean, I know where it's at, but I might drive to the stables, but I'm not going down in there because, like I said, there's so many people come out here. I don't know how many YouTube channels. That I've seen this come out here where she was swimming at the last day she was uh, I guess saw anywhere today she went missing she was out here swimming with her mom and then like I said uh, of the horses out here that's about it I might have come out here once I don't know I have to look back through my videos and see I guess They charge to come out here and ride horses. I don't know how long the trails are or anything. I don't know. Somebody down there fishing. Let that run it again. Lake look like it's up pretty good out here. I don't know if that affects it out here when they drain it over there or move it down as much or not. Might be down a little. No, it's getting cool. I can tell it in the air. There's the horses. 
काम नहीं हो in the snow or something then. Oh, big boy, that's a big old horse, that white one with that black thing. Big. Back up, it's a little bit cool on me. That's my GoPro beeping where I had it going the other way. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> Excuse me. I had it pulling up towards the horses, and uh, I had it pulling towards that guy we're fishing, but I didn't have it zoomed up. I was probably going to get some snow tonight, be my guess. Ways. I'm going to head back to the main highway out there and uh, head back towards Johnson City. I'll turn this on again before I get back. I just don't want to record what I've done recorded coming out here earlier. So, to get back into Johnson City, I'll uh, turn this back on. Catch y'all in a little while. In Johnson City, Tennessee, and it's trying to snow. Time I turn the camera off, and then it stops. <laughs> this fine snow. Enough to get everybody out here running around going to the grocery store, buying up bread and milk and gas. day I can't sleep good the night before and feel like I can take a nap see, see it down and I'm about to stop here somebody's basing that man got the base cannons on that beating bang boom 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 Understand what's the point of that? So he's a Snapchatter. <clears throat> he's on Snapchat. You must have heard me turn it down. <laughs> get out and get much uh, riding around in that ice snow we had. I was, I mean, my mom was sick. I thought they got out and went around and videoed a little bit in that snow, but I tell you what, there for a few days, I didn't feel like even hardly moving that long getting out riding around in the snow.
about quit again. I think I'm about to switch back to rain. So it looks like looking back towards farther back I can, as I can see, look like it's coming down pretty good back there towards where I live. Straight on back. Back towards the mountains, so I guess you could say. But I will be back. Down here in North Johnson City. Got one in front of me, thinks she's in the Fast and the Furious movie. Smoke. on my way to the house and uh, she came around that corner back there. I thought she was going to try to slide it around. I didn't know what she was doing Well, the roads was wet. Anyway, I'll get this uploaded in a little bit and hope y'all enjoy the video. Been a little rainy and snowy ride back to the house. I'll talk to y'all later. Y'all have a good evening. God bless y'all. Bye-bye now. Yeah, yeah,